What's up guys, it's your Motivational Gamer here, and welcome to episode 13. Last episode we made, we made some new friends. Uh, we did some stuff with the Wilkerson's, helped the army out, learned out about artillery, um, or calling in artillery to blow up some Zeds. So this episode we're going to head back down, we're going to go talk to Ray Santos and see what this sweet ride deal is, and see what he can do for us. Um, and then let's see where the story leads us in this episode of State of Decay Domination. <clears throat> Excuse me, so yeah. The game is getting pretty interesting. Uh, definitely making some diplomatic connections. Uh, they haven't given me the okay yet to move my base is really what I'm, I'm trying to get to so uh, we can expand because right now our fucking base is little as shit. We're like in a play school playhouse. And that is no plus bueno. Getting close. If you guys haven't checked this game out yet, um, it's a lot of fun to play. Uh, it's only like 30 bucks or 20 bucks or 30 bucks or something like that on the uh, Xbox One store for the uh, digital download. I don't, unfortunately, I don't think it's available for PlayStation. But, um, definitely a sick game. Initially came out for the 360 again, and they revamped it. And they put all the, uh, expansion packs together. Playing this, I think the next game we're going to play after we clear this one is going to be either Witcher 3, or... I don't know, probably Witcher 3, or maybe we might do Dying Light. Take a break from the uh, go do some more zombie action or something. I haven't decided yet. I've heard a lot of good things about The Witcher. I have, like, I read about it for, you know, briefly, but I definitely uh, heard some, some crazy things about it, so I am curious to check it out. Um. Okay. Am I supposed to go in there? Yeah, I'm thinking so. Let's go. Well, what do you think? It's a car. It's for me? Sure, why not? I've amassed a fair little collection since this business went down. I can spare one for a new friend. It's all about people pulling together, after all. Mm. And uh, speaking of pulling together, Exactly. I wonder if you wouldn't be able to do me a favor. Yeah. The folks out at the old Ballard homestead have been having trouble with one of their trucks. I happen to have some parts to spare, so I was figuring on running them out there. Don't suppose you'd be interested in taking this little beauty for a test drive? Happy to help. I knew I could rely on you. By all means, you drive. It's not too far. Cool. Everybody always wants something. Nothing is ever for free. Oops, oh, there goes the car, dude. Thanks. <laughs> I just crashed it into a fence post. That's how I feel, bro. Handles like a dream, doesn't she? I had yeah, one just like her as a younger man. Whatever you say. Ah, uh, yeah, this takes me back. The open road, Let me make sure I'm going the right fucking way. Of course, when I was younger, I usually had a stacked blonde sitting next to me. But hey. Can I... Huh. Say, wonder if I could drive all the way through. Cathartic? Head up this way. I want to show you something. is taking me so I can't go through the field this is there we go see those zombies let's run the bastards over wait what come on it'll be fun 
Take out some of your aggression. Blow off steam. Trust me, this baby can take it. Let's get these bastards. Pretty good, man. Your commentary is a little off, dude. Might as well take care of this. Okay, okay, that was fun. But I suppose we'd better take care of this delivery now. Let's go. Holy shit, guys. See this fucking plane crash? Holy. When the fuck did that happen? I don't remember that should be in there. Is that new? Has to be. It's crazy. That is crazy. Hey, Ray. Good to see you. Howdy, folks. Heard you were having some engine troubles. Figured I'd drop by with some spare parts and see if we can't get the old girl back on her feet. I owe you one, ma'am. Don't even worry about it. I'm happy to help. Say, you got any spare lumber in your barn there? I know some folks who are running a little short. Oh yeah, sure. Help yourself. Don't mind if I do. Thanks. As for you, you take care out there. And enjoy the ride. I'm sure I'll see you around. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a badass, yo. Alright, so what the fuck do I have to do now? What's this? Find out what Quinn wants. Seek and destroy. Friend in trouble. Uh. Alright, let's go find out what Quentin wants, since it's pretty much on the way. And then we'll make a full loop, and then we'll go save the friend. Holy fuck. Goddamn zombies. out soon it may be too late do what you can all right probably not a bad idea to switch up your weapons every once in a while we can fix up your broken ones overnight oh okay cool. oh so that's just been breaking the damn weapons Where I gotta go now. I'm telling you, man. Good. Th <laughs> Thank God for uh, unlimited fuel in zombie apocalypse situations. Could you imagine if they added uh, fuel as a resource in this game and you had to maintain that? It'd be absolutely insane. As much driving as they have you do. I think they definitely could have, uh, I don't know, uh, you know, as far as like the main story goes, I guess it had more like uh, connecting events, but uh, I don't know. Maybe they did that so the game wouldn't feel so linear. Hey, thanks for showing up. You're welcome, bro. What the fuck do you want? Things are getting pretty hairy out there. And time's not exactly on our side, if you know what I mean. Something's been bothering me. I can't quite shake it. People been looking at Becca and whispering a lot lately, and... and then there was that whole thing where the sheriff kept calling her Alex. I don't know. Maybe it's none of my business, but... If you happen to run into him, could you ask him what he knows? I really like this girl. I just want to make sure I'm not making a mistake. 
Don't you think that's something you should ask her yourself? Right. I don't know. Yeah, maybe. I guess so. Thanks. No problem. The fuck? No fucking time to be playing goddamn private eye. What the hell's wrong with you? With some balls, bro. You go ask her. What an idiot. Alright, friend in need. Let's go do it. Alright guys, more driving. It's like a giant road trip. There's my old car. I swear, like, they need to make... A game developer out there somewhere needs to make a zombie fucking game. Kind of like this, like, or a GTA style. A zombie apocalypse game where it's like fully customizable. You create your own character, you go, obviously the permadeath is real. Um, you know, when you die, you just, you know, recreate or start over or whatever, however they want to do it. And uh, make it so, you know, every, everybody works together, you know what I mean? Like graphics like this, of course, were better. And, uh, you know, have it like MMO or if not, just a single player or multiplayer game where there's a full uh, interactive world out there. You know, so, I, I don't know, I guess kind of like a Fallout, but with zombies. That would be fucking sick. But I guess I got stuff similar like DayZ. I, I haven't played those yet though, so I don't I don't really know uh, what, the, uh, what the capabilities are yet for those particular games. to help a friend. I'm all talking to you guys, Jory riding. <laughs> Let me go. <laughs> She's probably standing outside like, where the fuck is he going? I bet. Anybody in here? Even here. What do you want me to find? Nobody's here. We got gas. We got food. Nobody's Consider here. This one searched. Oh, okay. Multiple buildings. Oh, of course. Uh -huh. Nice try, motherfucker. Nice fucking try. Oh, fuck you, bro. Anybody in here? <laughs> Trying to be slick. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. All that bullshit you was trying to do. Damn, man, he's smacking, crushing the shit out these heads. Yo. Yo, where you at? Wherever you are, who are you? Where the fuck are you? Not in here. Maybe you're in here. Yeah? Yeah? yeah. Anybody in here? Yeah. Oh, thank God. Hey. Time to go home. Okay. I think I'm ready to head home now. All right, Abigail. Hi, cutie. I'm not alone in here. Break its fucking skull! Oh, don't worry. <laughs> ah, epic kill! Epic kill cam! Epic kill cam! I, I don't get. I, I don't see like how killing zombies could ever get old. I mean, you had RPG elements. You could level up. I mean, can I? Zombies on our right. 
what's better than this? Alright, let's wait a second. Let my man cool off here. Heads up. Oh Got shit. Activity at three o'clock. Big dot. I don't know what the fuck it is either. I almost don't want to find out. Oh, army zombie. Okay. Oh, man, I thought that shit was going to be like a fucking... Oh, hey man. Are you fucking running out the damn wood? Little fence line like that, little forest line. Tree line. Yeah, that's what I'm looking at. Tree line. Don't... Hey, don't fucking judge me. Alright, don't fucking judge me. Not exactly used to being rescued. I've been taking care of myself pretty much my whole life. Mom skipped town when I was four. Dad was high more often than not. Learned pretty quick you can't count on anybody else to look after you. Sorry, I'm rambling. I'm trying to say thanks. Nice to know the end of the world hasn't turned everybody into selfish assholes. Abigail, girl, shit. Here we are. Okay, that's all we needed. I can't thank you enough. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Who we got here? Take care of. What's the word? Come on. Yes. You and me are gonna go out there and kick some ass. You'll feel it's better. my action. I'm on it. Uh huh. Okay. I see. I see. You acting all coy. Don't want to talk to me. Don't want to hang out with me. And now you see me with Abigail. And now you want to get in. Okay. I see. I see where this relationship's going. That's fucking bullshit. Some pretty scary shit going on out there, huh? You can say that again. Hell, if I'm being honest, some days I don't even want to get out of bed in the morning, you know? I guess. Fail pickup line, bro. Fail pickup line. You got to come better than that, man. You finally get an opportunity to have a conversation and that's what you, that's what you say? You say you don't know, you feel like you don't want to get out of bed? <sighs> Somebody please help me. Please help him. Help me help you. Oh, I can't cut through the brush. Alright guys. Note to self, don't go that way. That, should we kill them all? Okay. Now we're gonna kill some zombies the old fashioned way. Yes we are. Yep. Stop screaming, bitch! Yeah. Yes! What else we gotta do? We want a house, I'm assuming? Yeah. See? Things aren't as bad as they seem. Appreciate it. Guess I'll follow you. Let's roll. That was a short date. I mean, we didn't we didn't even get no ass grab or nothing. No, no tickle, no hug. Look, you're not alone. Everybody's scared. Just don't do anything stupid, okay? Yeah. Okay. Sure. Damn, man! Strike two. Another fail. <laughs> Look, 
I'll think about what you said, okay? Thanks. Oh shit. They just walk up in there, huh? How's it going? So long. Bye, please. Alright. What else we got going on? Seek and destroy. Eyes in the sky. Feral Zed. Right, well, I guess we're just kind of free for all right now. Could help him, but let's roll. There are still a few things to do out there. Where? Where are they at? Don't tell me new guns fell off and you don't even like pinpoint it on the map. Just acquired a stash of military style weapons and I feel like sharing benefits of my of being on my good side. Ah, uh, okay, that's the stuff that uh Okay. For helping them, got it. All right, here we go. Reckless action time. We're gonna do this fucking court all by myself. All by myself. <laughs> oh, oh. Maybe that, uh, wasn't a good idea. Definitely might not have been a good idea. Damn, I'm tired. But maybe it was, motherfuckers. <sighs> Yo, I see a red dot. Fucking asshole. A zombie just taking a nap. Hey, cutie. Hey, how you doing? Shut up. Rice cracker eating motherfucker. Oh shit, we got a screamer, guys. We got a screamer. What the fuck are the snipers doing? <laughs> Lure him. Let's go. Hey. Over here! Oh, <laughs> yeah, he's you taking know, rifle shots to the face. It may be too late. And time's not exactly on our side, if you know what I mean. Yeah, right, dude. There is no helmet, bro. No helmet. At this range, that's Let's stopping a rifle I round. It a little while ago. If you're hearing this, you some help. Sounds like they're in a bad spot. I want to offer them a hand. Here's the location. Seriously? <sighs> Alright, so we're gonna let this guy rest. And then we'll bring this episode to a close, guys. Uh, thank you guys again for tuning in. Uh, next episode, we'll go ahead and start clearing out some more missions and uh, see if we can get some more survivors in the camp and uh, expend 
ex expand expand our little little castle here. So thank you guys again, and we will see you guys next video. So thank you guys for so much again, uh, every single one of you. I love every single one of you guys. Thank you for your support and uh, you know your interaction in the community, and we will see you guys next video.